Hey guys, welcome back to No Catch Name. It's me, Ella, and it's been a while. <laughs> I think it's been, um, four days since I made a video? Somewhere around there. But anyways, we are finally recovered. <laughs> we all got sick here over the last weekend and into earlier this week, but we've been recuperating, and we spent the last two days cleaning up the house and getting everything back to normal from, you know, where sickness just throws everything off. So I just wanted to hop on here and share with you guys some stuff that I've been crocheting on and some bags and bags that are still in the shop from the last update and let you know that everybody who ordered bags last weekend uh are going they're going sh they're shipping tomorrow <laughs> but anyways let's hop into it <laughs> so i am a little out of breath because i just got done cleaning up a little bit more and i just i had a moment so i thought i'd come in here so if i'm breathing deep for the first few minutes of the video it's because i'm catching my breath <laughs> but uh De devin's got the kids in there so yeah and ignore this mess behind me it's just stuff gets thrown around <laughs> So, I guess first we'll talk crochet, because um, a lot of times uh, when I wasn't feeling good, I was working on this in here in the bedroom um, while watching TV, <laughs> and I got a little bit of progress done. I was pretty happy with it. So, let me, I got it all just kind of in my trick-or-treat bucket, because <laughs> it was sitting over here, and I had pulled it out to get ready, you know, for Halloween coming up, and I just ended up using it as like a whip bucket. So, uh, last time I talked about my whips was, I was working on the little Grinches that I'm making for the christmas um craft market that me and my sister are doing in early december and i think it was just i think i had bits and pieces of them i didn't have like any one whole one but right now i have four bodies <laughs> so i did complete all four bodies and then two of them do have faces that i embroidered on there they're slightly different but that's okay i just hand stitched them all on there because i didn't want to use safety eyes um and also, I forgot to get my safety eyes. <laughs> but anyways, two of them have faces. So the other two, I need to embroider faces on. And then I got to, they got little hair that you put up on the top. And then they also have scarves. So I'm going to make those little scarves too. I was just trying to get all the green done. And this is pretty much a whole ball of um, Red Heart Super Saver green, spring green, except this much right here. So I was able to make four whole Grinches. <laughs> and then I'll do their little hair out of the green. And their scarves will be... Um, red and white striped and then I do have their faces just uh black and bright yellow for my heart so they're getting right there this is a free pattern it's supposed to be an ornament it's supposed to make it with a smaller yarn and hook I'm using worsted weight yarn and a four millimeter G hook it's a free pattern by I think it's Little Crochet Farm and it uh, when she made it it's an ornament but I've only made it as Amber Groomies I think I made the first ones two years ago and then I made some last year, and now I'm making some this year. <laughs> it's just a really cute pattern. I do love it. And, uh, yeah, so there's him. I got four of those. And then for my September Halloween, um, and we're going to for my trick-or-treaters. I'm getting cut really, really close because tomorrow's the last day of September. <laughs> but I just made some ghosts, and I can't remember the pattern. That's my Grinch pattern. Um, but I will link it down below. It's, the pattern is supposed to have a witch's hat, but I don't know if I'm going to make the witch's hat or not. I did make the little ghosts, though. So here's the little ghosts. They don't have a face yet. I'm going to use puffy paint to do their faces because I forgot to get my safety eyes. And I didn't want to stitch it on there because when you stitch it, you know, you have to bring the yarn through the amigurumi. And since it's white, I was afraid it would show really bad. So I'm just going to use puffy paint to put their little eyes and maybe like a face on there. I don't know. <laughs> I mean a mouth. <laughs> so it is a cute little pattern. They do got little arms way down there. And uh, this is a free pattern. Actually, I found it because um, Neva from Manic Mama Musing was talking about it. She made this, but I can't remember if it's the same pattern. Because she was talking about a ghost with a witch hat, and she showed hers. And then I just looked it up on Ravelry, and I found it there. So I'm not sure if it's the same exact one that she did. But I will link it down below so that you can check it out. So I made the three little ghosts. This is just Red Heart White. And I also used G-Hook because I, I just used the one I had near, near me at the time, which was my Grinch. So I, I used that hook from there. But So I got four Grinches and three ghosts done this week except i do gotta do like the details and make the scarves so i guess the gritches are done but they're getting there but anyways my bucket's just got my yarn balls and stitch markers down in it and my little needle tube and my little snippy things and uh, that's just my little whip bucket for right now i'm gonna throw all these back in there that's all i've been working on crochet wise um having you know when i was sick obviously i didn't feel like really do anything <laughs> but uh as I got better, like, um, I did most of that crocheting actually yesterday. <laughs> I sat in here while I was watching Grey's Anatomy on the TV, and I did most of that crocheting. 
just all in one setting because um, you know we're still recovering from being sick so it just takes a while to get back to normal but that's what I've been working on I wanted to do a Wednesday video but I just didn't you know it just was didn't work out it didn't work out and I thought I'd do it yesterday and then it didn't work out we ended up being gone all yesterday we had a lot of errands to run from where we were sick and we didn't do anything all right so the next thing I want to show you is in here <laughs> these are the bags that are still in the shop they haven't sold yet so I wanted to show them to you in case you want to go check them out and then the next set of bags, I'm waiting for some stuff to come in the mail. I need, I'm waiting for my labels to come in the mail and the stuff to make handles with. Because I wasn't going to make tote bags, but then I changed my mind. Because I think the Christmas bags will look better as totes, but that might just be me. <laughs> I don't know. I just feel like I don't want to cut the fabric, the prints up too small to make drawstring bags. So I think I'm going to make tote bags, but maybe not all of them. I don't know. <laughs> we'll see. Once it comes and I go through it, let me separate these out. So there are, how many? There's four prints still in the shop, but there's two of three of them. <laughs> so there's seven all together. So there's two left of this game print. It's got like controllers and game sayings, and it looks like, um, like Pac-Man dots <laughs> all around there. And it, the liners of it is like, um, Space Invaders. I forgot what that's called. But they do have no Notion pouches. So there's two of those. And there's two sets of the cats left. So they're cats like on computers. <laughs> and it's just really cute print. So those also have Notion pouches. There's two of this print. It's like a floral print. It's purple and blue and green. Really pretty floral print. One of them has the purple inside still. And I think one of them, yeah, one of them is the dark blue. There's one of each. <laughs> left and those are sets as well they have no sure pouches and then the last one that is in the shop is this glasses print and it's got blue on the inside the cats have gray the cats have gray on the inside and those are all the ones that's in the shop right now and after that it may be a week or so i was planning i was hoping to do my next update next weekend but then we got sick and i had to order some supplies and it just now shipped today, actually. I ordered it a few days ago, and it just now shipped. So, um, I won't get them until you know, next week sometime. So, let's see here. Next Saturday would have been, what is, what I mean, it is going to be the 7th, right? No. Yes. Because Sunday's the 1st. So, it'll probably be the 14th-ish, maybe, that I can have some bags up. There will be some Christmas bags. Maybe not all of them, but some of them. And they may or may not be totes. <laughs> And I might also have some regular fabric, you know, just not holiday themed, um, that I might also do. I don't know. But I do want to do, like, two Christmas updates. But anyways, those are the ones still in the shop. You know, the rest of it is just talking and me showing you some stuff that we got. <laughs> or, and that I got. Let me put these bags back in this bag. So that they stay clean and all that stuff. Okay. First, I want to show you our ornaments. Every year we buy ornaments. We try to buy ornaments that go with something we did this year, the past year. This year we didn't really do much. <laughs> we, we thought about zoo because we did go to the zoo recently. But the only zoo animal Hobby Lobby had, and we were looking at Hobby Lobby, that we saw at our zoo was the giraffe. And I just I did, didn't like the giraffe. So we picked out one and Jesse picked out one. Look at this paper. It's so loud. Alright, so the one... Jesse picked out is really similar to the one he picked out last year. I can't remember exactly. I'm pretty sure the one he picked out last year was black. And it had a red bag of chips on it. But he picked out another video game controller. I think he the one last year maybe looked like a Switch. I don't remember. I'll have to wait till Christmas time. And it's got like snacks hanging from it. <laughs> so that's the one Jesse picked out. And it was $8, but it was half off. And then the one that me and Devin picked out for the family was... It's funny. Da -da, a chicken nugget <laughs> in ketchup. Because we all love chicken nuggets here and we all love ketchup. <laughs> and it says nugget time. This one was $7, but it was half off. Uh, but it's adorable. They had chicken nuggets in ranch and in um, honey mustard too, but we got the ketchup one. <laughs> this is the last ketchup one. So I guess a lot of people got that. But a chicken nugget. <laughs> I thought that was so funny. But that's our ornaments this year. I don't know if we'll get any more, but we do like to try. I usually pick out one for the family, and then Jesse picks out one, and then as June gets older, we'll let her pick out one, too. Um, and we'll just have a bunch of ornaments. <laughs> but I just love that so funny, the chicken nugget. All right, and the last thing I have to share is Devin got me a boo bag. <laughs> he had been seeing them on TikTok and stuff, and plus my sister 
sent him a video of one. So he sent me, he got me a boo bag. So it's a Halloween bag. And inside of it, he had these sticking out. He had it like nicer looking than I did. He had these sticking out the top. His <laughs> witch legs. These are meant for like a, I guess your yard. But I would never put these outside. I wouldn't want them to get damaged. I might save them and maybe make a wreath next year and stick them out of the wreath. But that would be cute. But witch legs. And he got me a bunch of Halloween things. So he got me some uh, garlands. He knows I love to decorate because he lives here and he sees it. So he got me some pumpkin garlands and some ghost garlands <laughs> to hang up, which I have to do. And then he got me some squishmallow pins. They're pins. And then this is like a squishmallow notepad. It's got a cute little notepad paper in it. And he got me a headband. <laughs> so I'll probably wear that in some of my videos coming up. And then he got me some fingernails. I bought fingernails the other day, so now he, he bought me a bunch of fingernails. So he got me this set. And then he got me this set. And this one. These are the press-on ones. But I do still have some of that nail glue, so if it... Because I feel like the nail glue would work better. I used to wear press-on nails all the time by Kiss. I was wondering if these had names, because the, the other kind, the ones I had, they had names. I don't think these ones do. They're still on the front. Oh yeah, they are. Uh, oh, this one's called in the dark. That one doesn't have a name. This one's called Spiders and Sass. <laughs> this other two don't have names. Anyways, and then the last thing he got me was pair of pajamas. So he got me these pajamas. These are the pants. And the shirt. see <laughs> the shirt says that so I think that's so cool but anyways I gotta open all this stuff and take the tags off and stuff and uh then we got this extra reusable bag it's got that on that side on the side it's got a witch <laughs> so yeah I love him to death he spoils me rotten but uh I'll definitely wear this coming up and I might wear this to like some of the trunk or treats and things that we do with the kids which is coming up I'm so excited I can't believe October 1st is on Sunday I get to start my October um, swap. I got it already. It's sitting in there waiting to be opened. <laughs> well, I did already open it and look at the card. But, like, I mean, everything inside of it. <laughs> I can't wait to do it. Um, and then October will be coming up. So, I'm excited about that. Hopefully, I'll do it better than I have been doing the 100 days of Halloween. But life is just busy with two kids. And then us getting sick. It was just out of the blue. Well, I'm not used to us being sick. We haven't been sick in, in a while. Um, we were sick all the time when Jesse was in public school. And I hated that. And then I was sick when I was pregnant with June. The end of it. I stayed sick like that whole time. But anyways, yeah. I'm going to hop off here and put all this stuff up. And uh, I might work on my Grinches. Do the, the other two faces and their hair. Because <laughs> I need to get their hair done. And then I can just do their scarves and they'll be done. And then I'm going to puffy paint the ghost faces. And that takes a little while to dry. Usually overnight. So I might do that and set them up somewhere and let them dry. But yeah, so I'll leave those two patterns linked down below. My shop will be linked below if you want to check out those bags that's in there. And then I'm going to hop off here and I'll see you guys in another video. Bye guys.